Hey guys, Infernal here. How you doing? And we're back for another episode of the Empire Minecraft Let's Play. I'm up in my treehouse. No real reason. I just haven't been up here for a while, so I thought uh, I'd come up and have a quick look. Have I still got my iron boots on? Yes, I have. <laughs> oh dear. Right, so what are we doing today? Well, it's going to be a bit of a short one. I've been very busy. That is why I haven't uploaded in a while. Um, let's start with home. Let's start here. Oh, Minecart Madness coming soon. It is indeed. It's pretty much finished. Um, yeah, I can do more to make it look nicer and nicer, but it's a, uh, it's pretty much at the stage where I can open it. So, possibly by the time this video is open, or open, <laughs> gone online, maybe a day or two after, pop in, jump in the portal, go and have a look. Uh, well, we got free stuff. Okay, we've got a bit of free stuff in there for people. Free stuff. Yeah. Okay. So it's free stuff if people want it. We need to reset the giveaway today as well. So uh, let's do that. Off to the home base. Top down temporary storage. Right, what have we got that we can put in the giveaway? That's all a bit of rubbish. We just want something nice. What would people like? Well, we've got lots of slime heads, so let's put a slime head in. Uh, right, let's put a diamond block in. Uh, should we put some iron? Yeah, people can just go to the iron farms. That's not really that fun, is it? A couple of bits of lapis. What's worth stuff? What have we got over here? Little blaze rods. Let's put a couple of blaze rods in. Yeah, let's put five blaze rods in. What else should we get? End of pearls. No, was in leather. How much leather have I got? Oh, there. Uh, you're not doing too bad. 32 leather. Lots of slime balls. Okay. Stack of slime balls. They can go in there as well. Right. Let's go and reset it. So. Boom, 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 boom. Put that in there. So what are we doing? On the left hand side is white. So. If you want to uh, pick up all that stuff for free. I am. Can I teleport myself in there? In D D D D D, in it goes. So, land in here. Watch this video. So let's do a quick pause. I always do this. So I always forget. So let's just make sure. Uh, do a quick pause and check which video it, it is. Mind you, you see, it's a bit pointless because if you, we don't need to. If you're watching this, you already know which video it is. And if you arrive, I'll just do this afterwards. So. Input block one today, that is white wool. Input block two today, that is red wool. Bump, door is open. I can't get in. <laughs> uh, and then just come and help yourself to the stuff. Excellent, so let's go and reset that. Funny if someone ran in now and took it all. <laughs> well, it would be funny actually. <laughs> it would be probably a bit frustrating. Right, let's. Uh, I forgot how to do it. How do I get it? Right, take one out of there, that's it. And we take that one out of there, right? So, uh, and then we climb up incredibly hard for me anyway. Parkour, first time without falling off. I'm getting better, getting better. Reset the sign. So, that's that's reset. So, pop along and get that if you're interested. There's a little bit of free stuff in there in the foyer or porch, whatever you want to call it. Come along and get that. Right, now I am going to. I'm going to take a quick cut. I'm going to have a look around, just check on my res, see what we're going to do, and then we'll make our way down into the mines. Right, yeah, so we'll do that. So, uh, quick little cut, and I'll be back with you in a moment. So, um, randomly exploring uh, my residence, and there is a flying pane of glass. <laughs> Bad man Simon is hiding in my roof. <laughs> What's he doing up there? Oh, oh he's run away. What is, it? what is he up to? That's quite scary. It's quite scary. <laughs> oh, being watched. Run away. 
What am I doing? I'm dropping off supplies. Dropping off supplies. Down in the mine cart. Madness. So let's go down to the bottom. So all I've been doing, so this is probably going to be a shortish episode because all I have been doing is running around this place, putting gravel in, um, collecting supplies. Whoop, down I go. And I got a reference to a certain city on tracks. Am I a reference to a certain city on tracks? Right. <gasps> oh, and who's that? I recognise the skin. That's dark. What's that? Why, why am I being stalked by mods? What's going on? Oh, where is it? Uh, my name. After uh, I'm trying to make a PS3 account, I spent over an hour. It wouldn't tell me why I couldn't have the name. Um, and I was thinking, beep machine, you. you know, I was getting quite frustrated. I didn't want to swear, so I didn't want a rude name, you know, so you damn machine. Infernal machine is what I went for first. I couldn't have that. It's already taken, so I got an infernal device. And I turn out it's from a series of books, isn't it? Um, I can't remember the name. Female author, someone will be able to tell me. Uh, I think she did. Immortal something. I've seen the film. They've made one of the films. I've seen one of them. So there's a question I do get asked a lot. Probably why I get hits on my uh, Google Plus page. I think probably people are after the books rather than... Uh, rather than me uh, but me is what they get <laughs> okay so dropping off some supplies all oh, this down in here got too much stuff mm. so basically i've been running around putting loads of gravel down decorating it takes so long i still don't know why you're hiding around that corner if you've gone afk i could block you in should i block you in no you'll tell me off uh so, so it just takes ages not much to see uh let's see if i can find my way down somewhere. I filled in one of the lakes. Is it this way? Could be around here. I've turned this place into a maze. Yeah, see, one of the lakes is filled in. It will have a waterfall coming down there at some point. So we're getting there slowly. Getting there slowly, guys. All right. Um, uh, probably quickest. Let's just jump back up. Um, the giveaway has been accessed, and I have mail. Mail. I think that was Mr. Mr. Montoya123. What's he dropped? Whoa, you know, he did tell me he dropped a piece of iron off, or some iron. That is a huge amount of iron. Wow. That is extremely handy. Thank you very much, Mr. Montoya123. I don't know where the name comes from, Mr. Montoya. Hopefully it's uh, Inigo from Princess Bride. I love that film. My name is Inigo Montoya. You killed my father, now prepare to die. Right, now I'm going to take a quick break. Well, that was a very sharp cut off. I started rambling more rubbish than I usually do. But here we are in the mines. You can see I put the waterfall in behind me. And there it is. And I've just been running around, just adding a few sort of bits and bobs, details, chests and things. One day, maybe a game we can put, give everyone a container and just hide five diamonds in one of these chests or spread them around. People can come and find them. Black hunt the button. Filled in the other lake. Yeah, you see a few more details. So this is kind of the standard of everywhere now. I said we could put more in, make it look a bit nicer, but it's good enough for our purposes. Not our porpoises. They are like dolphins, but for our purposes. So what are we going to do next? Well, we've reset the giveaway. Uh, I did notice um, that the slime sanctuary I made or at the iron farm that got griefed, but unfortunately I haven't had time to fix that. I'm just lost in this place. No, I haven't gone over to fix that yet. Too busy doing other things. Haven't, um, here we go. I haven't been over to the base on SMP8 for a while, but I do know that it's fine. Someone check that out for me. So there's nothing happened over there. We're going to have to go back. But this was my priority, getting this fish. Not still there, are you? No. No, good. Maybe be hiding somewhere else. Hmm. 
but this was my priority getting this finished so we can get some stuff done in there right so come along they get quite frustrating after a while I might have to remove them blatant advertising there as you can see <laughs> not that you need it because you're obviously on my channel already so we need to set up a little thing in here so people can pop through and pay me a little bit of money to have a go on the minecart um, and we're going to use a nice little uh, easy system uh, so what we're going to do let's jump to my test world and we'll have a quick look Ah, pixel arts to the left of me, command blocks to the right. Here I am, stuck in the middle on my test world. So, what about some mine? Let's face forward, makes it much easier. Which one's this one? Item checking combination lock. Ah, this is what we use for the giveaway. Uh, basic item swap shop. This is rather pointless, this thing. You sort of like put one item in. Whoop, and it gives you a different one. But it's only got like a, a I think it's a cycle of three. Put the torch in. Oop! Zombie flash. Put a sign in. And I should get the redstone back. Oop! There we go. Wasn't that fun? Pretty simple. Pop her into a little dropper which just drops it back up in there. But you know, I didn't build one because someone could just come along and fill it with dirt. A bit boring. I could just put a filter on to filter out the dirt. But I thought, what's the point? This is what we'll be using the chest shop plugin pay to enter door. Now, I've shown you this before. I did make one improvement though. It now uses a dropper instead of a hopper. So you've got a bit more control of it. So this is a chest shop. Well, clearly it's not, but it would be if I was on Empire Minecraft. And inside the chest shop is some red wool, but I'd do dirt. So what happens here? Okay, so it's a trapped chest. Oh, we broke the shop. <laughs> well, we've got that. And that's checking to see if there's an item in there. If there is, you know, there's a signal. So I take the item out. Signal comes down and around. Boom, boom, boom. Just up under there. You can see the little bottom of the torch there. And that opens the door. So you can then come through, step on the pressure plate. You step on the pressure plate, which activates this. This would be a message as well. Sensor signal all the way around to the not a very good description to the dropper and the dropper pump puts another piece of red wool back in. So let's do a bit of a test. Actually, you don't need to do that, do you? Yes. But there we go. You know, it'll annoy me because I don't need that one. There we go. <laughs> uh, and let's put a sign up there. Completely waste of time, but we're going to do it anyway. Mm -hmm. Right. Done. So that's my shop. So I come along. Boop, boop. Ooh, mine carts. Yes, I wouldn't mind a go. Buy a ticket for 10 R. Oh, or dirt ticket. Okay. I shall I shall buy that ticket there. Mm, door is now open. Now if you're quick, you could get a few of you through here at the same time, I think. But and then we'll wait. Stand on that. Right, we're not being teleported, because I didn't bother setting up the teleport, don't need to here. But when I get off. Bump, door shuts, reset, ready for the next person. Okay, so the teleport will be that sign there, that'll be a teleport sign, or probably a message sign. Well, there's name tags over there. And then uh, the message will be in here. Oh, it's a load of armor stands. It's a randomizer, in fact. That's what I used in my command blocks on the Infirmium series. We're gonna have a look at that when on the next Infirmium episode. Quite a nice randomizer. I'm going completely off topic. Let's have a quick look. Boink, 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 boink. Do like that. Got that from Dragnels. Do check him out. Okay, so that's the door we're going to be using. And uh, let's head on back. Oh, let's see put the sign in there. Oh, my, red <laughs> my redstone torch has come back. Let's head on back onto Empire Minecraft. Now we know what it's going to look like. I'm not going to remember all that. I should take a screenshot. Bing! Okie dokie. Alright, <laughs> see you in a moment. And we're back in my lobby, foyer, porch place. I say this is going to be a short episode, so I'm going to wrap this one up here. Uh, right, so what we're going to do, well, I'm not right here, but in a moment, I'm getting ahead of myself. So, pop along soon, a couple of days, and uh, this will be open. Go in, it'll take you to the room like you just saw. Uh, pay a little bit of money. 
you know, just to go towards all the stuff that I had to make down there. Some days I'll leave it free, maybe, you know, bonus coming for free. Some days it'll be, it's never going to be expensive, maybe five or maybe ten rupees, something like that. Okay. Uh, also keep your eye out because I will be starting the hunt the button and the uh, see what, the treasure hunting where you just put random stuff in the chests and you just go th and root through them all and get whatever you can. Which, you know, might bring some people. We'll do some recording on that if they do turn up. Keep your eye out there. So pop over, check out this sign, see what it's going to say. And it'll tell you when. Pop in here if you want to do the, uh, the YouTube giveaway. Check earlier on in the video for for the two input blocks and what is in the chest. If you do feel like donating any stuff into the free stuff chest, please do just come along, pop it in and other people can come and grab it. So I am going to leave you here. Next video, uh, well, we're going to have, it's going to be about the minecart madness really. That is going to be up and running fully operational. We need to build a little event lobby for us all to sort of cram in waiting for the uh, push the button or treasure hunt event to start you know and then set everyone down into the mine into the mines and they can all uh, go off and explore and get some free stuff could be fun so i will see you next time and might go up in the tree we've not done anything with that tree house for a long time hmm i'll have to get up there soon no ideas what to do though got any ideas just you know pop me a comment always helpful okay so i hope you enjoyed it I will catch you next time. Check out uh, the Infernium videos if you want. We've just done a UHC over there. Uh, we did pretty badly. It was our second go because we did have a test. But I will catch you soon. Press the like if you liked. And please sub. Catch you later. Take care.